Hello, this is Michelle Knight from michellenight.com and this is the astrological update for Libra for the week starting the 21st of June. Now this week, it's a bit all stop and go. You could get a little bit frustrated because the signals are go, 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 and then halt. And you're like, what is going on? I know I'm a Libra and I can be balanced, but this is ridiculous. And that's basically because we have Mars in the ninth, and that is square Neptune in the sixth. Now that's like very annoying for you because it's like, I want to expand, I want to explore, and uh, Neptune's kind of leading you down the wrong turn and wrong alleyway of life, and you could be tempted to rush off and try and do something different career-wise, maybe in a different culture, or spread your wings in some way, but could it be an illusion? Now, the very, very good news is that we have Sun in the 10th and it's trining Neptune in the 6th. So this is a completely different information. And you're like, my goodness, you know, which way if I put my little antenna up, are the planets trying to lead me? Because obviously with Sun in the 10th, you're like, yes, I'm feeling very confident about my career. And, you know, and, and I'm, I've got some quite good ideas. So it's a question of knowing when and where to expand and just allowing yourself actually to enjoy the moment. Being the present is the best advice I can give you. This present moment is obviously all that we have. And actually it should be, each moment this week should be quite joyful if you don't try to be a little bit too forceful, adventurous, or allow yourself to kind of want to expand in the wrong direction. You can do it, take advantage of it, be, be loving, be free, be happy, think about what you want to do, dream about what you want to do, but don't necessarily leap into any adventure if you get warning signs. Now, as an air sign, you often intellectualize your desires. And actually the planets are saying to you this week, just tune in, check your body out. You know, our body's a very good gauge of whether something's right or wrong. If you're planning a big adventure or trip or transformation or whatever shift that you want to plan, just check in with your body. Does it feel right in your gut? And use that as your barometer this week. I send you lots of love and I'll speak to you soon.